Yeah, I don't want any either. So the two of you can take six. Because nice. Vic's already got a couple. Tangle Actually, how many do I already have? Idiot. I have a gun, so I don't need something else. The range. I already have three of these. I'll take five. Jesus. You can have seven. Jesus. I will take the Tanglefoot bags. Is it sad uh, that we're talking in absurdly high numbers like this already? There's 120 arrows. I have eight Tanglefoot bags now. I have seven. What a marvelous so it's 120 technology. 120 arrows to add to uh, Steve. Steve gets I'm a pretty shit sure ton of arrows. Just... So, has used two arrows... We could just paint a but room in Tanglefoot goop right now. Has <laughs> kinky. Let's put those in the has gained 118 arrows. I don't know if he can actually carry that many. I'm assuming Val's carrying some point. Trappity wow. trap check. Ooh. In position to you shoot. Do not see any traps. I'm going to ready in action to shoot some, the first enemy I see beyond that door. Why, I, right, haven't, why I haven't been doing this before, I don't know. This is a good question. I'm going to make a perception check to the door. Who's hurt, by the way? Oh, that didn't go well. Not me. I haven't taken damage the whole campaign yet. <laughs> eh? Alright, you're opening the door. Right. Yeah, made a perception check. I don't think I've turned anything. I'm asking yeah. in character who's hurt. Uh, Val will That's all you see. Okay. I could use a little touch-up, Doctor, if no one else needs your attention. I'm just gonna remain ready to shoot the first enemy I see, since there's obviously another door there. That's for Val. Get eight. How much damage has Corrin taken? Well, I'm gonna go on to YouTube and listen to the ODST soundtrack. <laughs> Ayla um, ODST soundtrack. We, we knew what you meant when you said ODST. Yeah. You'd be surprised how many people think. don't know what I mean when I say that. Um, we're not thinking. completely retarded. I how much damage has Corrin taken, Rowan? Um, I took three in an earlier. He I looks fine. Yeah, I think I'm okay. Oh, you've just got a couple of scratches. You'll be fine. All Superficial right. lacerations. Oh, you're right. Doctor, did you heal yourself? I was just about to. Oh, okay. I, on the other yeah, hand, that... have an arrow sticking out of me. Yeah, that first date <laughs> went to Val. Uh, Excuse she's me? Looking for... She's looking all right now. Oh, there we go. Nice. <laughs> nice. Whew. All right. Uh, perception at this door. Okay. You hear nothing. Doctor, care to check for anything untoward? I still sit here or just waiting for the door to be flung open to shoot enemies. Ah! You're standing on Steve! <laughs> <laughs> Get off him! Crunch! Oh, I'm Steve. sorry. Steve starts humping your leg. <laughs> ah! Ah! Get off! Get off! <laughs> no! Bad Steve! Bad! Let's ah, go! My mace? Ah! You see nothing. <laughs> well, he flagged it as adult content. We've got to make it adult content for you. Just... Well, okay, it's... I open the door. All right. Nothing in here either. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to move into the room. Okay. I suggest and we I'd go like to... this way just what to see if it kind connects of with floors the floors. Uh, stone. Probably Stone floors, okay. Uh, I'm gonna make a perception check to. St I, I want to see if there are any footprints. Okay. Like dirt in the footprints. Yeah, this is like stone, dirtish. Okay, that's just enough. You notice that there are, that there are tracks heading uh, into the doorway. You notice that there are at least uh, four sets of tracks. Which door? Heading to this door. All right. Do you I relay this? Uh, there are tracks heading. Yes, I relay this. There are tracks heading towards this door. Probably the goblins that ran off earlier. 
if they kept running. All right, uh, perception at the yeah, door. Yeah, I'm gonna have. Can, I'm gonna try and move Steve because that's a perfect place for me. Since again, I can just sit there and move Steve. First of all, move Steve. You can shoot too. Steve likes shooting. Perception at the door. Yeah, but this is the best position for. Just gonna. I'm gonna laugh if that's a hallway and it's the worst position for you. Um, what should we call it? You hear nothing and see nothing. Ready then to get ready. Okay. I'm ready to shoot. Well, to... Oh, I really want to write a perception macro, but I'll hold on to that for a little bit. Uh, oh, little God. Bit. Fuck. Well, <laughs> you bastards, you knew this was coming. Interesting. I told you. I so Step totally told you. To the... Oh, it's not a closet. Okay, oh, but it is a hallway, right. and that makes it hilarious. Let's keep going. Ooh. Huh. All righty. And proceeding further. Hey, yeah, this boy. There we go. Oh. Checking for traps. On the stone, where's the percept? There we go. Wait. Oh, you damn, you walked through. Um, we'll be able to talk no about traps. traps. Alright, what's down uh, this way? Oh, seen? right. Sorry. Boop. Um, I'm going to roll another perception to see if I can still see the tracks. Okay. So which way are we going to go? This is important. Alright, so... So you see two... So you see two sets of tracks. Um, one going... You know, this way, and another one going this way. Okay, but no tracks leading towards the door where the doctor is? Oh, there's still tracks heading towards the door where the doctor is. Oh, okay. Same group. Uh, so, four tracks heading towards the door up north, and then... Or two tracks heading to each floor? Um, two tracks heading to this door, one going to and from. Okay. And then four tracks... Heading towards that one. All right. Uh, so let's check out the door to the north. I really, I relay this this information. You may want to let me get ahead of you, there, Doctor. Oh, sorry. Excuse me. Pardon me. There we go. <laughs> I hope you didn't nick yourself on any of the spikes. All right. Shall we line oh, up? We're going through that door. <laughs> Yeah, the uh, more tracks leading towards this door. And like, let's open it. Um, long out. Okay. All right. Ah, wonderful. We've seen this room before. It had things falling from the ceiling. Step in. Okay. Nothing happens when I step in. Nothing. Okay, keep going. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna wait for the open I, door. I'm going to continue to perceive the door. <laughs> oh, no. Ah, shit. Uh, you see nothing wrong with this door. Well, everything's probably okay. Let's open the door. Ready to shoot something if it's there. Okay. From here. Ah. <laughs> oh, oh right, you're opening the door. We can okay. trade places here. You take that one and I'll be in the back oh, my shooting things. Gosh. Step through the door. They it's really like time. their doors here, don't they? Assume I'm just walking with my with my rifle ready to fire at this point. Just like over right, um, Ephraim's shoulder. Gonna, ch gonna check this door. Somehow through everybody. Alright. Steve is ready to stab things from between Corn's legs because he's got reach. I don't think I see anything gonna open the door. Everyone everyone um let's see. Oh, you three make reflex saves. <laughs> Who is you three? Oh, <laughs> the oh, three fuck. in the room. Okay. Um. Oh, shit. Oh, poor Steve. Oh, Damn Steve, it. No. I'm gonna break Steve. Uh, maybe. That's you, I'm assuming. That's me. Does Steve even get a reflex save? Yeah. He does. He does have a dex mod, so he does get a reflex save. Eh? His is the same as mine. Oh! oh there we go, Steve. Boing! Alright. 
More shit falling from the ceiling. No. Um, as he tries to open the door, uh, fire comes out of the door. What the fuck? Oh, so wait, which three needed to roll then? These three? Yeah. Okay, we we didn't Yay, know, so we assumed, it was the, we assumed it was these three. Oh, okay. Does so. it have to roll an attack roll? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, so, no, I'm asking because some traps actually do have to roll an attack roll. No, no, no. Uh, it's a burning hand spell. Reflex. So Steve has a reflex like a boss, and then Val just kind of haphazardly. All right, eats. so... Wait, do I actually have the you, best Do you continue opening the door? Do you continue opening the door? What's your reflex save? Uh, Six. That's what mine is. Fuck no. You don't proceed opening the door? Fuck no. I do it, not proceed opening the fucking door. There's, It's shooting fire at me. It's a natural it's inclination already, to stop. It's already finished shooting fire at you. I call back. Okay, so does anyone want to check this for any more traps? <clears throat> I kind of nudged the doctor forward. Just finish opening the door. You've already started opening it. It, it tried to burn twice. me. I don't... I feel I've like I lost my trust in the door. <laughs> I feel like if the door had any other traps, they would also have gone off. You don't know that. All you right, fine. The door. Thank you. I moved inside. Excuse me. <laughs> Anything? You see nothing. You see nothing. <coughs> pardon me, excuse me, one side, beg your pardon, sorry. We'll see this time, so it would be your well. Alright, I open the door. Okay, you open the rest of the door and you get pelted by arrows. <laughs> and <laughs> the dog gets a shot. And that that dog gets shot too. Alright, shoot. Um, yeah, it takes a oh, 10 damage. Yay. It, it just straight up takes 10 damage, it's dead. <laughs> Roll initiative, everybody. <laughs> See, this is why I did it, because I knew it would be coming handy. Yay! Your gun was effective <laughs> twice tonight. <laughs> it's about to be I effective. Knew personal best. It's about to be effective again. <laughs> Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I have a 23. I'm going to shoot first. They are still flat foot. <laughs> flat foot touch. They are boned. You can technically shoot anyone in the room. Still, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Line of sight on Leon, you go first. I will now shoot that goblin. All right. Uh, hmm. does not hit. Flat foot touch. Does not hit. Aww. But it's flat footed See, and it's against should, touch. It should have you like should a. Have got ahead of yourself. Well, it should only have an eleven at that point. Ten from base, one plus one from size since it's small, and then that's it. Dex doesn't count because it's flat foot. Which means it doesn't get anything to its touch. All right, it was only wait, no, right? Hmm. All right. There's certain bonuses that apply to it, but most of them Doctor. go away when they are flat foot. Unless he's got some sort of deflection bonus out of the stacks. Doctor. That doesn't go away. All right. But, yeah. Um. Doctor. Doctor, we need you to throw things. We need you to throw things really, really, really good. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, I have to get up to them. No, you don't. No, I have to get up to places where they can swarm me. Oh. Yeah, and you want to stay behind corn. Nobody lives forever. Oh, God. Don't do it. Did Dr. Ephraim Belford just YOLO? Yes. <laughs> yes, he did. <laughs> so 25. That guy's visibly injured. Throw it at somebody else. I can't believe you did that, man. Uh, Which one's visibly injured? The, the, the one in the middle. One. He has a bullet hole in him. Yes, he does.
Okay, that one. He's bleeding from the oh god. Alright. Can he actually Wah! land a bomb? He can. Oh! Yeah! Oh <laughs> Hot diggity dizzle. They take six fire damage and I'm gonna pull out my mace because I know this is going to hurt. <laughs> Dog is gonna come hurtling after you. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. And let's see if it hits. The doctor is gonna visibly cringe. He is going to miss. Oh, well, why am I not injured? What? And the arrows are also going to miss. <laughs> wow. Corin! <laughs> you are the luckiest son of a bitch right now. I closed my eyes and they couldn't see me. <laughs> <laughs> That's totally how that works. It has to be here. Provoke an attack of opportunity. For the I suggest that after this yep. fight, we take a bit of a break. Miss? Yeah. Does it hit? No, it misses. Uh, and teleport chat to the fucking skull. Hits. Hopefully. Teleport your damage. Drops. Yes, you can charge him. Yeah, yo. Val! <laughs> That's what I was waiting for. <laughs> How did you know? Charge with a warrior cry. Ah! <laughs> oh, I'll <they> harm you. <laughs> Plus two. Yeah, I counted it as a 22. Um, it's not dead. that I needed to power attack. But, you it's, know. It's dead. Why not? Um, let me double check. <laughs> I'm so happy my bombs are actually doing things. Yeah, because you actually hit somebody. You you guys hear a loud tear, as in clothing being teared, and a little child scream. Uh, it's totally not done with my turn. Oh. Come on. Uh, Steve has to run forward with his long spear, and a open mouth that looks like he's charged or screaming, but he's a skeleton and he can't, but he misses. He just feels like, <laughs> Hang on, hang on. That, that might change. It's a nine, even if you flank with the wall with the ten. I don't think he's gonna hit. I mean, if he does, that's fucking awesome. Steve's he does boss. not hit. Yeah, I didn't think so. He would have been a boss, though. But let me just double double check on that. Go to Benicatenda. It actually doesn't change my action at all, so I'm just gonna move up here. It's a double move, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna, I'm gonna shout, don't open that or I'm gonna just kinda say, Don't open the door until I say until I'm ready. That way I can uh, get the immediate shot off if I need to. Well, Steve's not gonna open the door this. Steve's a skeleton. <laughs> You give him too much intelligence. What's wrong with you? <laughs> All right, so roll your attack. I'm not attacking. Oh, he doubled Doctor. Okay, did the. Wait, why are we not attacking the goblin? Because no, I double almost. moved. He just moved, so he couldn't. I oh. moved into this position for a reason. In fact, I can only guess and what. Steve just <laughs> failed. <laughs> Okay. You can make a single diagonal at five feet. You know that, right? Yeah, I know. Just making sure. Bonk. No bonk. Nope. No bonk. No bonk. You do not get a beast count. But he'll out. promote if he tries to do anything at all. Yeah, he like provokes. drawing something. <laughs> he provokes. He's uh, dead. So first Steve. Dead. Go Steve! Bonk. Steve All right. <laughs> that Go one, <laughs> that one poke, the one damage poke from Steven. Fucking Steve with the kill stealing. <laughs> All right, so you guys hear some goblin snickering. <clears throat> so I'm gonna turn face the door, rifle ready. So you know the goblin. drill. Steve, with yep, can goblin you, you, cynical you, laughing, laughter. Can you back up one, actually? Uh, because if Steve, Steve backs up one, me. then now Steve has reached through the door. 
if somebody tries to open it. Fine. Because Doctor. spear. <laughs> Doctor! At your 12, you hear some goblins talking. Do you speak goblin? No, and I was checking for traps. Oh. You checked for traps poorly. So poorly that you actually heard goblins. <laughs> It's like putting your so very poorly, in <laughs> fact, like, you understand problems. Goblin. I am going to, however, actively listen. Alright. So, this is where the mature content comes in. Oh, here it comes. Yay, See? Goblins are going to be speaking in mature languages. Does that mean they're like elder senior Goblins? Are they seniors? <laughs> Do they get the senior Behind citizen the discount at the Goblin bar? Are you good now? You ruined the mood. <laughs> yes! <laughs> we, we had something serious going, and then you had to open your mouth. <laughs> no, it was Steve. Where's the duct tape? Steve can't say anything. He totally he just meows words. occasionally. <laughs> he meows okay. occasionally. He meows right. occasionally. He can say right. something anyway. What do I hear? What do I hear? So, how do you hear? So, now that... So... Ha! <laughs> down. See, you ruined it before I did. Uh, <laughs> you ruined it. I had everything written down, but fuck it. He basically says that that she's now all alone and no one's going to come and save her. <laughs> One of the other comments says, "But boss, we'll get in trouble if the boss finds out." And then the comments are laugh and say, "Ha! Huh, our our client only asked for the little girl to be alive. Didn't say anything about torturing her." Oh, please tell me you, Corin, uh, say this out loud since you already know yes, that Mal has been a rape slave. I am, I am, as soon as everything finishes, I whisper translate. Oh, it's still going. To... It's still going to go back and oh, forth God. of like, and you're going to hear the occasional clothing being torn. We need to get in there now. Open uh, door? Val wants to make I... a strength check to move you out of the way. You can see she's furious. Does Corin open the door before you do that? Well, I fucking open the door. Okay. You open the door and all the goblins stop and kind of look at you. Roll initiative. And I can't see any of them from this position. Uh, Actually, no I, can, I can see that one. Oh. Oh. I can so I can see totally about to talk to you can technically reason. see that one. Yes. So I can see the guy, that one, so that one's getting shot. He takes eight damage. Actually I eight. think he He no, might have cover. He takes nine, actually. He might have you hit. an angle pack. He oh, takes nine much. damage. Drops. And now initiative. I just made that a lot easier. It's a good thing I don't go so fast now. Then, <laughs> I got well, my use. I got my usefulness out of this fight early. Apparently, Valerie is going to trample the doctor. Valerie is on my initiative. Anyone? Valerie, you're going. Way. You're going. Oh, um. Valerie can move through teammates without penalty. Yes, that's my explanation for my crap initiative roll. She walks there. She'll provoke if she has to. She's ah. raging. Okay. Uh, dropping into rage, and then she's going to cleave. Uh, cleave up, so, I assume. Uh, Where to the side? She, the two closest to the girl, so she's going to go sideways. She's going to go that way. Uh, and that is plus two, so sixteen hits. And then, oh, oh nice. yeah. Good. Confirmed. Oh, nice! Great confirmed Shit. on the next guy. Okay. So, fourteen to the first. Well, Se actually, plus three. So seventeen uh, to the first. Seventeen drops. to the first guy. Now, since I just crit and then confirmed it, can we say that as I killed him, none of the blood gets on this poor little victim? All right, because I was going to say <laughs> you do double crit damage and you hit him with the flight of your blade. Basically knocking the life right out of him. Nice. I like that. So, uh, 20, no, excuse me, 17, so, uh, 34. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. then she snarled, hold on. 
stabity stab. Okay. With a long spear. Fourteen. Hits. <laughs> and then Steve just comes in and stabs people. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna tr I'm gonna draw the rapier again. Come, actually, let's do that move just so that I can say, let's see, there to there to the one diagonal to there. There we go. Oh, uh, Val would have said something along the lines uh, in common while she was raging. Uh, Don't lay a fucking goddamn hand, Cleve, on her again. And I'm go gonna ahead. stab at the goblin. Yeah. Uh, well, balls. Confirm. Ooh. Could be worse, it's just a rapier. Yeah, you're fine. Corin. Alright, I can't really get in that clusterfuck. Yes, you can. You right Don't here. think. Two, three, four. Oh, no, right. I can move right in there. And Tarabucha. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's dead. It is dead. <laughs> Well, and you got to imagine let's... it's only got like two or three HP right now, anyway. <laughs> it's and dead. It it's oh, it's like, dead. Like, like, you sever its spine from its body. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I love my terbucha. <laughs> see what? No, see what happened was you walk in, you see this thing, and you ram your shield forward, squishing it between your shield and the wall. <laughs> At the end of combat, the uh, elf girl is going to kind of scurry over to a corner, scared of you guys. I'm gonna uh, go try and Val's comfort her. Out of rage. And, but yeah, uh, she's gonna try and get away from you. She provokes. I don't do anything. I, I like I have my hands up as I walk over. I obviously don't have a weapon in my hand or anything. She's still yeah, gonna scurry I, away I, from I, you. She can't. I won't walk over. Moved to where she was. Uh, wait. Sheathing her great sword. I also <laughs> sheathe my weapons and she's take off my helmet. She's probably more scared of you, Val. Well, maybe, but... Just, wait, just, don't corner her, you morons! I just, I just walked go, into wait, the room. Wait, you're safe now. I'm gonna roll a diplomacy. <laughs> we don't, we don't need Steve in the room. Steve can leave the room. That'll probably help it. I want to assist the diplomacy. Okay. I need to be able to... I'm gonna lower my hat. scarf, smile, oh. and wave my hat. Roll your diplomacy to see if you help. Uh, I will do it as well. I have a... Oh, that's right. I have a plus one to this. I have a non-existent diplomacy bonus, so let's... I definitely try and assist. Uh. Yeah. That assist well, right I'll... there. Uh, <laughs> Can I take I'll... over as the lead negotiator? Uh, <laughs> I got a nat 20. Okay, let me do oh this. My God. <laughs> I don't help very much. That was not very diplomatic. You guys good? My nose is oh, running yeah. excessive, is bleeding excessively from being trampled. <laughs> She's gonna kind of get on her hands and knees, lowering her head and saying, "Please, please don't go out to my miss. Please don't go out to my sister. Please leave us, leave her alone. Take me back. I don't want you to bother her anymore." What happened? I say calmly what? in Elvin. What language what is she? Speaking? Elvin, I assume. Yeah. Uh, she's speaking Aquan. Oh, Aquan. Oh, shit. oh. None of us know Nobody that probably. Knows. Sorry. Scratch that, Elvin. Okay, I know this. I don't know Elvin. I look Damn. around confused. Where's Arconia when we? I need know him? Elvin. So the doctor and I can communicate with her. Yeah, but Arconia would be perfect for this. <laughs> we we don't want her. No. Like I said, I I, I no, kind of really would be perfect for this. I kind of. Oh, really? Her, her clothing's basically torn. You can basically see her undergarments at this point. I'm gonna take. Uh, what do I have? Their clothing. I'm uh, going to take off my coat. I was excited. I'm going to pull my outfit. My, uh, I'm assuming an entertainer's outfit is probably going to close or something. We, we've, so got I have we've got a coat. That. That's, we have a coat. We'll use the coat. I have a big, heavy yeah. alchemist coat. Entertainer's outfit. It explodes, would give it to her. Yeah, I wouldn't have suggested you get, get closer or, to it. I probably should, considering, you know, I actually can diplomize, apparently. Yeah, we're the, we're the only ones she isn't fucking terrified of, I guess. I don't know. Roger's the only one she didn't see shoot anyone. Well, excuse me. The lieutenant's the only one she didn't see kill anyone. Grant, well, he did I didn't kill the anybody in Actually, this room. Actually, the doctor's probably the least intimidating of all of us. That may be, but the doctor rolled a throw on his diplomacy. Also true. <laughs> Regardless... So 
So I kind of coat. Yeah, I'm I'll, I'll, it off. I'll take. I'll take the coat and kind of just and hold it out for her. She's still trembling, still kind of in a begging kind of stance. We're not going to do anything. You're safe with us. What's going? What happened? She still doesn't move. Guys, just it's just I, I kind of motion everybody to back off. Just leave her. It'll just kind of yeah, step back. She needs some time. I wouldn't suggest you let her leave, though, Doctor. Like, kind of like maybe wait, like a back up back there, or something. I was actually going to head back and uh, guard the. I'll join you. Yeah, yeah. All right, but I, I do leave the I leave the coat over there. I'm cold. <laughs> <laughs> So how long are you going to wait? A while. All right. Um, in about 10 minutes or so, she's going to kind of look at you, look back to the coat, and kind of grab it, and then uh, kind of cover herself a bit. Still hurtling in the corner. I told you, we're not going to hurt you. We're here to help. This is the same, This is the little Ellen girl from the caravan, right? Yes, you can definitely identify as her. I just wanted to confirm that. Come on, let's get you back with the others. She'll so kind of can make a diplomacy check real quick. Ah, oh, balls. Okay. Just enough. All okay. right. She's nice. gonna, she's gonna kind of get to her legs at the. She's gonna kind of get on her feet at this point. Don't worry, I'll protect you. Won't let anything else happen to you. All right, she's gonna just kind of slowly move out. Her hand going on the wall. So I kind of I raise my voice. Going back to the caravan now. Yes, sir. I will uh, lead the way back through the uh, dungeon uh, to the caravan. Anything worth looting was looted. Yes. Um, and it is that's... here that I must take a leave for 10, 20 minutes. So. All right. A little so bit of a break it. for you guys. Cool. Awesome. That's fine. I need to be anyways. All right. So I'll, I'll put I'll post loot from uh, the goblins. Yeah, from the last two rooms. <laughs> oh yeah, last two rooms. Which was uh, what, six, three. Three dogs, three goblins. There's going to be a bulk special on Tanglefoot bags at my stall, isn't there? Yeah. Oh, most likely. Uh, I'll so, this and... For Vic, because I think she wanted to hold on to a couple. But I'll just grab the rest of the Tanglefoot bags and put them in my bag of holding. Yeah, you know what? That's that's a good idea. You can carry all the Tanglefoot bags, and then anyone who wants them can keep them, and you can sell the rest. Idea. Um, I'm actually putting everything though into the party loot. If you click the um, characters tab and go down to party loot and notes or party notes slash loot, I'm keeping track of all of this for us uh, there. All right, that's uh, how there. many? Oh, you've already got sweet six sets of the armor. Okay, so what about the Tanglefoot bags, other gear, scale mail? That's how that's many of a, those? Just one. Just one. Okay, just one set of that, and then six sets of the rest. Yep. And all of this is small size. Yes. Okay. So you said you're taking the Tanglefoot bags. Yes. Okay. Then I will not add those to the list. Into I'll the extra any- dimensional oh. bag of holding. To hammer space with the. I just want it pointed out. I want absolutely no sharp things in this bag at any point. Fair enough. So now we have eight links. Of- I'm actually saying that in character. Nothing sharp comes near this bag, or else it might explode. Um, seeing the things that you pull out of there, let me just say, noted. 
<laughs> Thank you for they the literally warning. explode. Uh, and more arrows. Oh, I'm going to be right back. If we're taking a break. Am, yep. As am I. Pee pee. Six sets that is also small. There we go. We've got a lot of small shit, so. I'm back. Welcome back. So I've got a question. I have an answer. There you go. Would I be able to make a heel check to see if I've noticed any injuries at a glance? At at a glance, you can kind of you know take a look at what you can see, but you know that's only by glance. So would that be a perception or a heel check? Uh, perception. To see if you, you don't notice anything, any, um, you don't notice uh, any bruises or anything. So no bruises or a limp or anything? No. Nope. Alright then. Mind you, she's also holding herself up on the wall. Well, she was also almost raped, so she could be in shock if we're going by that scenario. I am probably going to ask her how she's feeling at some point, but now is not the time. Val has accepted that while she intended well-being because she understands where this girl is coming from, uh, charging in, screaming at the top of her lungs, and then just absolutely decimating two things in a bloody pulp. Probably not the best way to make her feel comfortable. <laughs> so she might not talk to Val, but at least she's safe. That's what Val cares about. You know, if we've got a minute, I'd actually like to make an appraise check on uh, all that armor and stuff we've been collecting see if i can't figure out what it's worth you you guys no, on lot. you guys know small. you guys know um by simple market video that they are 
what's it called? Um, they sell it full. That you guys know their market price, which uh, for small size is half the uh, price that you guys see in the SRD. In other words, go to the PFSRD, look up a long spear, scale mail, bow, etc., and then take half the price of that. Yeah, and that's how much we can sell it for. For full market uh, this, value. The sack of dead rats, the sticks, the length of string, we can't sell that. 